So guys, for the first step, you're going to head over to search and then type in Task Manager. Click on it. Now, once you're on this, if you see Roblox open, you want to right click on it and then click on End Task. So you might scroll up to find it. But once you find Roblox, you want to right click on it and then click on End Task. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search and then type in percent local app data percentage sign and click on enter. Now once you're on this, you want to scroll down until you find Roblox. You want to double click on it and then you want to find a Roblox player beta.exe file. You want to delete this. Now once you've deleted that, you want to click on the versions folder. Now once you're on this, you want to delete the version folder. I'm not going to delete it myself because I want to keep it, but in your case, you should delete it. So any folders that say versions on it, you want to delete them. If you do not see the versions folder, then instead you want to head over to search and then type in file explorer. Click on it. Then you want to click on this PC. You want to find where you have Roblox installed. So for me, it's on my C drive. Scroll down. Program files 86. Scroll down. Roblox. Versions. And then you want to delete all the version folders and the Roblox Studio Launcher beta. Delete all this. Now we're going to go back to Roblox on the top. And you also want to delete the Roblox Player Beta.exe file as well. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and then type in Roblox Player. You want to right click on it and then click on Run as Administrator. And then click on Yes. Now this will launch the Roblox Player app instead of the Roblox Beta app.